Helen de McCrockett, who goes by the moniker Pepsi de Mechel, recalled her first time meeting the now iconic bandmates of Wham! in 1983 as she joined the group to replace DC Lee. Speaking to Radio Times ahead of the highly anticipated Wham! documentary on Netflix, the singer shared, George was warm but quite intense. I was in awe of Shirley, this trendy, blonde chick, really confident. Andrew was like a gorgeous Labrador, friendly, bouncy and welcoming. The singer, who claimed that Andrew Ridgely hasn't changed a bit in the last four decades, added that the original Wham! member gave George Michael a lot of confidence as the late singer was very awkward. George Michael wanted to do third Wham! album The 64-year-old explained that while George was always more focused on the work and performing the music, Andrew was the one that offered personality on stage and thrived in front of the crowds of screaming fans. Pepsi also revealed that Andrew had been very gracious and delicate when it became clear that George was going to embark on a solo career that would launch him into realms of fame that the band would never experience together. Shirley Holloman and Pepsi knew without being told that the end was brewing for the band, adding that her concerns were cemented when George performed Careless Whisper on his own on stage. She recalled, watching him, we said, yes, he's going to make it. Don't miss! Singer George Michael was found dead in bed, cause of death, in sight. George Michael's cousin addresses reason he didn't come out sooner, update, the story of how George Michael wrote Magic Festive hit last Christmas, latest, although fans largely saw George's blossoming solo career as the nail in the coffin for Wham!, Pepsi revealed that she believes George was the one bandmate who reminisced the most about their Wham!, days. Following the band's sensational conclusion in 1986, Pepsi and Shirley started their own pop duo, a ply titled Pepsi and Shirley, and ended up rivaling George for the top of UK charts with their hit Heartache. The duo went on hiatus in 1989 and Pepsi started up her acting career, racking up roles on stage and screen before reuniting with Shirley in 2000 to do backing vocals for former Spice Girl Jerry Halliwell. Netflix's Wham! documentary is set to be released on July 5.